Hello everyone. Today I will discuss uh, assignment week 3 to week 7 for final examination which will be held on 29th of April. So what is the fundamental concept for week 3? So in this uh, assignment we are having a fuzzy set uh, A having membership value and uh, fuzzy element with the universe of discourse in this one. So in this first of all this is the universe of discourse fuzzy set A is given and after that we have to calculate um, complement of A. So in complement of A what we have to do just we have to subtract that particular membership value from one like uh, when we consider this case so in A complement so 0 0.4 1 minus 0 0.4 1 minus 0 0.4 therefore it will be equal to 0.6 so in this way we can calculate the complement of a fuzzy set a so in the same fashion 1 complement 0 0.9 complement 0 0.1 0 0.8 complement 0 0.2 0 0.5 complement again 0 0.5 so after that what we have um, to do a intersection a complement as we know we have fuzzy element a and its complement so just we have to take the intersection in case of intersection we have to take the minimum value so 0 0.4 0 0.6 minimum value is 0 0.4 so we have to consider 0 0.4 1 and 0 minimum value is 0 so we have to consider minimum 0 0 0.9 0 0.1 minimum value is 0 0.1 0 0.8 0 0.2 minimum is 0 0.2 0 0.5 0 0.5 this and when we look at this uh, for this particular element membership value is 0 so we can uh, obsolete it from the uh, final answer so this will be the final answer in the next case these are the question number 5 6 7 so a intersection a so a intersection a a union a always will be same so just we, and in case of uh, a union a intersection a union a complement we have to take the maximum of them so in this case uh, in this way we can calculate all this um, uh, all these type of questions uh, question number eight we are given with fuzzy set this one with universe of discourse this one so what will be the fuzzy set created after complement of a so uh, i already discussed complement of zero one complement of one complement of 1 0 complement of 0 1 and complement of again 0 is equal to 1 so this will be the answer 1 0 1 1 0 1 again uh, same type of operation a union a intersection a intersection a complement so we can evaluate all these types of questions week 4 fundamental concept this is very important uh, we have to find out the distance between two fuzzy set right so distance d for distance between fuzzy set a and b so in this particular case just this is the formula first of all we have to take the minimum value and after that we have to take the maximum value so how it will be calculated we are given with two fuzzy set fuzzy set a fuzzy set b so step one in step one what we have to do the value of for delta will be given by the expression below first of all we have calculated the value of delta and how it will be calculated delta will be equal to x a minus x b uh, for all uh, belongs to x a x b and uh, this all belongs to universe of discourse universe of discourse so in this case 1 minus 2 right and uh, this is the final execution step how to calculate 1 minus 2 1 minus 3 like in this way 1 minus 2 first of all we have to 1 minus 2 again 1 minus 3 and in last step 1 minus 4 so this combination will be there right so this combination will be there and in the next step 2 minus 2 2 minus 2 this will be there again 3 minus 2 3 minus 3 3 minus 4 this will be so total 9 cases will be there 1 minus 2 1 1 minus 3 
2 and we have to take the mode 1 minus 4 3 again 2 minus 2 0 2 minus 3 1 so value of delta is equal to 1 2 3 0 1 2 so in this value of uh, delta repeated but we have to consider only uh, that particular value uh, which is unique so in this case value of delta is equal to 0 1 2 3 4 0 1 2 3 so value of delta for this particular case is 4 right now we have to consider four separate cases in which of uh, first we will consider value of delta equal to 0 for value of delta equal to 0 uh, these are the two cases which we have to consider and we can directly consider it from here 2 minus 2 or 3 minus 3 right and for delta is equal to 1 uh, these there are four cases right for delta is equal to 2 again there are two cases and uh, for delta is equal to 3 there is only one case so in this way we will evaluate all these parameters the next step we already discussed this one we already evaluate this one now we have to make this table right so delta equal to 0 for delta equal to 0 we are we are having this combination 2 2 3 3 right now we have to write down the membership value of 2 for fuzzy element a uh, the value is equal to 1.0 for this case it is equal to 0.2 in the same way value membership value for fuzzy element 3 is equal to 0.3 and for this it is equal to 0.8 right so in the same way we have to evaluate we have to write down all the membership value uh, of the corresponding element from uh, fuzzy set A and fuzzy set B. In the next step, what we have to do? We have to take the minimum of them. We have to take the minimum of them. Minimum value of 1 and 0.2. Minimum value is 0.2, right? 0.3 and 0.8. Minimum value is 0 0.8. Mm, 0.3. And so on like in this case 0 0.3 0 0.2 minimum value is 0 0.2 so in this way we will evaluate this particular column right now again what we have to do for delta equal to 0 we have two options 0 0.2 and 0 0.3 but right now in this case we have to take the maximum value so maximum value in this case is 0 0.3 right so for delta equal to this we have the four cases and the maximum value is 0.8 so we have to consider the maximum value again 0 0.5 0 0.1.0 maximum value is 1 so in this way we will calculate and final answer or we can say final the distance between fuzzy set A and B will be given by this one right so now uh, the basic questions in given sample a and B two fuzzy sets are given so what will be the maximum membership value of the distance between set A and B maximum membership value is 1 okay and that is 0 0.3 0 0.5 0 0.8 and 1 so in question 2 what will be the membership value for delta equal to 0 when delta equal to 0 membership value is equal to 0 0.3 right so with the help of this table we can uh, give the solution of any questions week 5 assignment fundamental concept so we are having two fuzzy set fuzzy set a and fuzzy set b and uh, what will be the highest generic variable for value obtained c is equal to a plus b it may be possible c is equal to a minus b it may be possible in final exam instead of a plus b it may be a minus b it may be a multiplication b right a multiplication b it may be possible a division b a division b so any one of them can be appear in examination so just i write down this fuzzy set a so in this fuzzy set this is the membership value 0 0.1 0 0.2 0 0.5 and 1 okay and these are the 1 2 3 5 these are the fuzzy uh, these are the elements of fuzzy set a and in in this question universe of discourse is very important between the range minus 10 to 10 
in the same way i write down the fuzzy set b with membership value and fuzzy element right so in the next phase what we have to do we have to consider this element from fuzzy set a and we have to pair this element with each element of fuzzy set b right uh, for uh, instance first i am considering this particular element of uh, fuzzy set b this now what we have to do so point 1 point 2 point 1 and point 1 so these are the membership value so out of them we have to take the minimum because it is intersection so we have to consider the minimum value point 1 and the fuzzy element 1 plus 2 we have to add 1 plus 2 we have to add so this will be our first option now we have to consider uh, first element of fuzzy set a and second element of fuzzy set b so this there are four elements in a and four elements in uh, b so there are total 16 possible combination will be there 16 possible combination will be there right so in the next slide just i a four cases for this and four cases are for this so in this way uh, you can calculate all the 16 possible combinations and final answer will be look like this right and after that what we, you have to do uh, you have to rearrange them we you have to rearrange them because in, in this there are some element which are repeated two two three times so uh, what we have to take in the final step that's why we have to rearrange them so in this case point uh, fuzzy element 4 repeated two times this repeated two times again this repeated two times right and again this repeated two times and seven element repeated three times and eight repeated four times so what we have to consider so we have to consider Uh, the maximum membership value out of them so point 1 as it is because it is only single available at single one and in this case point 1 point 1 so we have to consider point 1 because both the membership are same point 2 and point 1 maximum value is point 2 therefore we have to consider point 2 point 1 point 3 maximum value is point 3 so we have to consider maximum value point 1 point 2 point 1 maximum value is point 2 0.2, 0.5, 0.3. Maximum is 0.8, so we have to consider 0.8. 0.5 as it is, 0.5 as it is, and 1.0 as it is. So this will be the next. Now after that, you have to take care that the universe of discourse is given in the range minus 10 to 10. But in this case, uh, it is 11. So it is out of universe of discourse. Therefore, we have to obsolete this option. so when we will count 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 so total 8 combinations are occurred so this will be the final step and what is the sample mm, a and b of two fuzzy sets uh, with the universe of discourse this one so this is fuzzy set a fuzzy set b now what will be the highest generic variable value obtained for c is equal to a plus b highest generic variable that is 10 5 plus 5 but 5 plus 6 is 11 but uh, 5 plus 6 is 11 but in this case uh, 11 is not in the universe of discourse therefore we have to obsolete so 10 is correct answer for the fuzzy number a and b defined in question 1 how many generic variable value will be obtained so as i counted there are only 8 values so in this way we can answer any questions week 6 fundamental concept so we have to take care of this sugino class of complement formula okay c lambda mu x and is equal to 1 minus mu x 1 plus lambda mu x oh, and the value of lambda will be lie in the range minus 1 to infinity both are excluded when lambda equal to 0 when this will be equal to 0 so denominator becomes 1 and this will be simply 1 minus mu x it means just the complement so this is the assignment 6 uh, uh, which i evaluated lambda equal to 0 and x is equal to 1 so we have to calculate this one lambda is equal to 1 x is equal to 1 lambda is equal to 2 x is equal to 1 so in this way we calculate all these particular values right 
simple question this what will be the membership function value at generic variable x x is equal to 1 given after applying the sugino class of lambda equal to 0 so you are given with value of lambda and value of x so just evaluate and it will be 0.9 again x is equal to 2 and lambda is equal to 1 so with help of these two value we can evaluate any of the particular values question number assignment number 7 that is week 7 fundamental concept we are having two fuzzy sets fuzzy set a and fuzzy set b first of all we have to calculate the fuzzy relationship and it is very simple and i will not discuss it so fuzzy set and after that first find fuzzy relation and after that we have to find the projection projection of fuzzy relation r on a r on a fuzzy projection how it will evaluate it so as we already determined fuzzy relationship r on a what we have to do we have to consider this particular row this and out of this will be written as this one and in the same way last row will be represented as this one and out of them we have to take the maximum value so maximum value in this case is equal to 0 0.1 0 0.1 and next in this case 0 0.7 0 0.7 so in the similar fashion we can evaluate the uh, maximum value in this case maximum value is 1 and in the last maximum value is equal to 0 0.5 so 0 0.5 so this is a projection value final value projections value so we write this one and after rearranging this will be our final projection uh, uh, of fuzzy relation r on a in the similar fashion projection of fuzzy relation r on b in this case instead of uh, row we have to calculate the uh, column wise this so maximum value is 0.1 in this case in this case maximum value is 0.3 in this case maximum value is equal to 1 and in this case maximum value is 0.5 so again we are going to write this and in the final step we will write this one so this will be the sample question fuzzy set a fuzzy set b so what will be the membership value for the generic variable x1 for the projection of fuzzy relation r on a so it is 0.1 so we can evaluate any one of them question number nine in this case what we have to do uh, let us consider fuzzy set this with the universe of discourse 0 to 10 and we are having the fuzzy relation uh, x a x is equal to this one for fuzzy set b with the universe of discourse this using the extension principle for mapping function defined below so we have to use the extension principle so, so now uh, y is equal to fx is equal to x square plus 3 so just what we have to do uh, x is equal to 1 then what will be the y value of y just we have to put in x is equal to 1 y is equal to 4 x is equal to 2 y is equal to 7 x is equal to 3 y is equal to 12 so this comes to be out this one now what we have to do these are the final value 4 7 and 12 and the corresponding uh, value will be considered as 0 0.1 membership value as it is 0 0.5 membership value as it is so 0 0.1 upon 4 0 0.5 upon 7 which is consider from this one and 1 upon 0 upon 12 because we have to drop this one because universe of discourse is given in the range 0 to 10 final answer is 0 0.1 upon 4 0 0.5 upon 7 so this way we can calculate thank you so much and uh, i hope so mm, your doubt will be clear and uh, after that i will upload second video which will cover from week 8 to week 11 thank you so much